Our top story on this first day of the work week, North Korea has fired an as of yet unidentified missile into waters off its eastern coast. The projectile was fired around two hours ago now and if confirmed as a missile it will be the regime's 12th launch of 2017. To give us more details on this developing story we have our uh, Yujin He on the line. So uh, Juni, what do we know so far? Yes, Mark. According to South Korea's Joint Chiefs of Staff, North Korea fired a missile at precisely 4.59 a.m. local time from Pukchang County, which is in the central region of North Korea, and traveled an estimated 500 kilometers. Now, the Joint Chiefs are still working to determine exactly what type of missile was fired this morning, but they say early signs indicate it was not an intercontinental ballistic missile. If confirmed, this will be the third missile test that has been conducted, conducted by Pyongyang since President Moon Jae-in came into office. And we also have reports just coming in from government officials in Tokyo who say the missile may have possibly landed inside Japan's exclusive economic zone, but those reports are still unconfirmed. And this latest launch follows the regime's testing of a KN-06 surface-to-air missile on Sunday, which was conducted under the supervision of North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. And also, Pyongyang state media claimed it was a success, saying the missile's capabilities have been upgraded since last year, and that Kim Jong-un has ordered for its immediate mass production and deployment. So, Juni, uh, President... Uh, Moon Jae-in has called an emergency meeting of the National Security Council in response uh, to the launch. Can you tell us more about that? Right, Mark. So President Moon Jae-in will be holding an emergency meeting of the NSC at 7.30 a.m., which is uh, less than half an hour from now. And that NSC board members are comprised of the President, his Chief of Staff, the Ministers of Defense, Foreign Affairs and Unification, as well as the Director of the National Intelligence Service. And uh, President Moon is expected to strongly condemn North Korea's missile launch. But for now, we're still waiting for more updates until after that NSC meeting gets underway. Back to you, Mark.